So hi friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video. So here in this video, I will talk about JEE mains 2022 that is updated marks versus percentile. As you all know, the date of the JEE mains examination for first attempt and second attempt has been changed now. So here I am with the updated marks versus percentile. So this video will provide you the aim that is how much marks you should target in order to achieve your goal uh, by this year of JEE examination. So, so here I will talk about all type of paper that is easy, moderate and hard type of paper as you all know different shift have different type of difficulty level and in and previous in year I have seen lots of different type of paper some we are too easy some we are too hard yeah, so, so I am considering all type of paper so that you can make your mind according to all type of paper. And and so, also I will talk about the cutoff for JE Advanced 2022 that is for all category general EWS OBC SCST in this same video so please try to watch the video till the end and if you are first to my channel please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get the complete information about JE Mains, JE Advanced and other entrance exam other counseling also in this same channel so please try to subscribe and share this video because very soon I will try to provide you the video on percentile versus your category rank because as you all know the number of a student will increase a little bit because of the performance of the examination so now, now i will try to provide you the updated percentile versus your category rank video very soon in this same channel in which you will able to get your category rank that is general rank obc rank scst pwd rank for a particular percentile so please try to subscribe it's my request to you so let's start this video so here is the data that is marks versus percentile so before going forward for this video i would like to request you please try to listen my word carefully then only you will know the complete meaning of the data that i am providing you here uh, here so, is the detail that is corresponding marks for a particular percentile that is for easy moderate and tough paper so here is the first one that is if you are targeting 99.9 .9 plus percentile then you have to score 260 plus marks for easy paper for moderate 235 plus and for tough you can get 99.9 .9 at 205 plus marks as well so let me inform you this is the updated marks versus percentile i have already, uh, I have already provided this video before but now i am providing you because the date has been postponed so many strength will do more preparation and, and so the competition will increase but one thing also increased that is the toughness of the paper because, because in previous year at the time of last attempt NTA provide a little bit tough paper so that will that will uh, neutralize the thing that is, that is due to the more number of a strength more competition will be there but, but the difficulty of the paper will also be high so uh, you, uh, you can expect to get a better percentile at, 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 at a reasonable marks also so you need so to keep uh, this uh, thing in your mind that is as the number of a student are increasing so more number of a student will able to get 99 percentile so for example if if there is 9 lakh a student so 9 uh, 9000 a student will get the 99 percentile but if it is increased that is around 10 lakh because this year i think that it will increase because all board examination will be done by the time of examination of j means for first attempt and second attempt so i think the number of a student will cross 10 lakh mark this year yeah, so, so in that case 10,000 student will apple to score 99 percentile so it is not like more number of student then you need to score more marks it, there will be difficulty of the paper also be increased that's why you can score better percentile at low marks also, also but you just need to be accurate in your examination so let's continue this video uh, that, is, that is for 99.8 to 99 percentile you need to score uh, 252 plus marks for easy paper for moderate 225 plus for tough 198 plus marks so now i will discuss only moderate uh, moderate paper marks you can check easy and tough paper marks sidewise so for 99.6 to 99.8 percentile your marks would be 215 plus and for 99.4 and above percentile your marks would be 207 plus and for 99 and above percentile your marks would be 198 that is this is a this is a important barrier for the student that is 99 percentile so for easy paper you can get it at 220 plus marks and for tough paper you can get it at 170 175 marks also and i am providing you the, uh, this data by doing a lots of research of, of, of last so many years and, and the trend of this year that is as i as i am as i am guiding lots of a student through the personal counseling and mentorship program so i know many students preparation how they are preparing so by taking the samples from those students i am providing you the information so please try to subscribe this channel like this video share this video so that i will get some support from your side and i can provide you more detail and more important video in future related to JE mains and advanced and other entrance exam other counseling also in the same channel so let's continue this video that is for 98.5 to 99 percentile your marks will be 187 plus that is for moderate paper and for easy and tough you can check sidewise so for 98 percentile or above that your marks will be 175 at least 
and for 97.5 percentile your marks will be 160 plus and for 97 percentile your marks will be 150 plus and for 96 percentile your marks will be 135 or more so uh, there are some more data for the marks versus percentile because i will provide you the data all the way up to 40 percentile but before going forward for this video i would like to inform you that i am providing the complete mentorship and guidance program and particularly for those students who are not enrolled in a particular coaching or particular institute and preparing by himself or herself so, so i am I providing the complete personal guidance and mentorship to those students so if you want you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number in that once you register with my guidance by paying a nominal fee i will be guiding you for everything that is first i will guide you for the preparation now how much marks you should consider according to your personal interest because different students have different type of personal interest i will, so I will I discuss will that and after, so after that, knowing that i will provide you the roadmap how much a topic you should consider how, how you need to do the preparation each day that is daily what should be your activity and if possible i will try to talk with your parents as well so that so i can I, know their expectation also from you so all those things i will be guiding you after your final admission will be done that is first for the preparation and once you get the result thereafter i will guide you to get the best, best college available at your result that is through josa counseling and csf counseling and if you will opt for jack delhi jack chandigarh or any other counseling or if you appear in other entrance exam such as comet k k KCET or okay. your stateable examination I will guide you for everything that is it means complete mentorship and guidance from now up to your admission is done so if you want you can contact me anytime through Instagram or WhatsApp number available in the description box so let's continue this video that is here is some more data are available that is for marks versus percentile so here is the information that is for 95 plus percentile your score should be 125 or more and for 93 plus percentile your marks should be 115 or more and for 90 plus percentile your marks should be 105 plus that is for moderate paper for easy and tough that is for easy you need to score more marks for tough you need to score less marks you can check sidewise so next if you talk about for 85 uh, plus percentile your marks should be 95 plus and for 80 plus percentile yeah, your right. marks should be 82 plus and for 75 plus percentile your marks should be 75 plus and for 70 percentile your uh, your marks should be 67 plus and for 60 percentile your marks should be 60 plus and for 50 plus percentile your marks should be 50 or more and, and for 40 plus percentile your marks should be 40 or more so this is all about the marks versus your expected percentile for easy moderate and tough paper that is updated for the J 2022 as you all know the date has been extended so according to that i am providing you the information by considering all the factors that is, that number, is number of a student may increase and the difficulty of the paper will also increase as i have discussed in my previous video that is what will be the effect of je postponement you can check my previous video as well so now i will i will talk about the cutoff for je advanced that is percentile and marks wise so please try to watch the video till the end so now let's talk about the cutoff for J Advanced 2022 that is the minimum marks or percentile that you need to have in the J mains examination to be eligible for the J Advanced examination. So before okay. talking about the data I would like to inform you that percentile remain fixed marks changes because of the difficulty of the paper. So percentile will remain same irrespective of the difficulty level of the paper you need to score the same percentile but for same percentile you may have to score more marks in different type of shape that is easy shape that is for easy shift you need to score more marks that, I will, that I will consider here and for, uh, for tough paper you need to score less marks so the same has been reflected here that is for general candidate you need to score 85 to 88 percentile and for that you need to have at least 75 to 105 marks that is if your paper will be hard you need to score 75 marks and for easy 105 marks if, and will if be your paper will be moderate then it will be between 75 to 105 marks so next if you talk about for OBC candidate 66 to 69 percentile and for that you need to score 50 to 80 marks and for EWS 64 to 67 percentile and for that you need to score uh, 45, 45 to 75 marks. So next for SC candidate 44 to 47 percentile will be the cutoff for J advance and for that you need to score 35 to 65 uh, marks and for ST candidate 33 to 35 uh, percentile will uh, do the work for you that is the cutoff for J advance and uh, for that you need to score 25 to 50 marks and particularly for SC and ST candidate if you will not able to uh, clear the cutoff that doesn't mean you will not able to get the college you will get the college but not the IIT you will get the college a lower NIT triple IT or GFTI college but you can get the college because last year I have guided lots of students who were unable to clear the cutoff but 
able to get the college ah, through Josa, through Josa okay. counseling and CSEP counseling. So this is all about the marks versus percentile and cutoff for J Advanced 2022. That is the updated data I have provided you after lots of research. So please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get all the update and information in the same channel about J Mains, J Advanced, and other entrance exam, other counseling also in the same channel. And very soon I will try to provide you the percentile versus your category rank. That is general EWS, OBC, SC, ST rank in the same channel. So please try to subscribe. It's my request to you. Thanks.